Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So over the last couple of days, I've been letting you know that Google is working on a new compact mode in Chrome that would reduce the height of the browser controls like the tab strip, toolbar, bookmarks bar, and so on, to allow more space for the web contents. And this is basically Google's answer to the Chrome UI refresh, I think, that increased a lot of the height of those components and added a lot more padding to the browser, which obviously is not the most favorite um, for a lot of viewers of this channel, I've, as I've mentioned previously, because they've also removed the flags, experimental flags, where we could roll back to the previous so-called more thinned out look and feel. Now, just to let you know now that, um, as mentioned over the last couple of days, we've been talking about it, having a look at some patches over in Chromium Garrett, and just to let you know now that uh, the new compact mode is now available um, in Chrome Canary 129, which is the latest preview version, and it's hidden behind an experimental flag, so it's still very early days. So this is basically just a quick first glimpse and look at what this feature is all about and what it could eventually become um, when and if Google rolls it out to a stable version. So we have to enable the feature by uh, turning on an experimental flag. So as always, we head to our Omnibox, we enter Chrome colon forward slash forward slash flags, and all you do in the search is enter compact. And here we can see the flag here at the bottom, compact mode for the browser prototype. Okay, so it's still uh, very early days, but nonetheless, the description for the flag reads, this feature is a prototype, reduces the height of the browser controls, that's the tab strip, toolbar, bookmarks, bar, etc., to allow more space for the web contents. We change that from default to enabled. We relaunch uh, Chrome 129 to apply that flag. And now you'll see if we head back and we right click on the tab strip, you'll see toggle compact mode. And there we go. So what it does, what it, what it has done is it's compacted the tab strip, the, the toolbar and the bookmarks bar. And if you want to get it back to normal, you click on toggle compact mode and there we go. So. Um, although it's giving you a couple of extra pixels um, for your web content, which is actually um, for the main browser window, um, which actually is the main purpose of your whole browser, um, not as much as I thought it would, but nonetheless, it's still early days and there could be a little bit of work to do on this. So that's normal. That's with compact mode. So it is increasing your um, main window uh, for your browsing and so on. So this is a nice move in the right direction. And... I'm very glad to see that there is this toggle available. So it's very easy at this stage to just toggle that on and off, and that's with it off. And I've also seen and heard that uh, in patches on Chromium Garrett, um, there's a good chance that Google will bring this to the context menus as well. So our menus should also get a little bit more compact, which I think is a great move in the right direction. So first glimpse, still early days. That's the compact mode. Toggle compact mode, we can see those components, the heart is reduced, and it's going to be interesting to see um, where this lands up and if and when it will roll out to the stable version. And I don't see why it won't roll out to stable. I think this is Google's answer to the Chrome UI refresh, which is not popular with a lot of um, users and viewers of this channel. So I'm putting it out there. I'm keeping my eye on this one. And obviously, as I get information, I'll keep you guys in the loop. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.